accessory digestive organ. Salivary gland, spleen, teeth, or liver. Okay, the spleen is the answer. Yeah, the spleen is a lymphatic organ. The teeth are accessory. Yeah, the tongue, the salivary gland, the liver, the pancreas, the gallbladder. Can you say that question one more time? Um, which of the following is not a digestive accessory organ? The it's salivary not gland, not. Yeah. See, I know the answer, I still don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I can explain it later. Okay. 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 Uh, okay. Uh, let's see here. Of the three regions of the pharynx, um, which one is the most inferior? Three regions in the pharynx, which one is the most inferior? Is it the oropharynx, the nasopharynx, or the laryngopharynx? Which one is the most inferior? Oropharynx, nasopharynx, and laryngopharynx. Oh, they one of the toughest words to spell in anatomy, pharynx. <laughs> <laughs> laryngopharynx. <laughs> you can try the second part. Anything. I think that question is too simple. 
Maybe that's why they're having trouble. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. No, you're delivering. Five, four, <laughs> two, one. Okay, Jessica and I balance, but Alex and I. What did Alex and I do? We never got it on ladder. Okay, nobody got it, right? No, she put two answers. She put liver and gallbladder. So the answer was liver. The question was, what organ produces bile? Right, you guys know that? What organ produces bile? The liver. The liver. I'm not really sure. Which organ is that? Okay, next question. Name the organ that stores bile. you whether or not you were reading directly from the exam. Oh, God. I don't know. I don't know. You can take 
Okay, what uh, in the eye? What's the main layer that contains the cones and rods? Name the main layer of the eye that contains the rods and cones. In the main layer of the eye that contains the rods and cones. Five, four, three, two, one. The retina, yes. Or no, it's not. It's not the neural tuning. Same thing. This retina. Oh. <laughs> Same thing. Outermost. Which of the main layers of the eye is the outermost layer? Which of the main layers of the, of the eye is the outermost? Five, four, three, two, and one. Yeah, fibrous tunic or sclera. Could you do those? The macula lutea is a region on the retina where there are no what, only what. Fill in the blank. The macula lutea is a region on the retina where there are no which kind of cells, no blank and only blank. Which cells? The macula lutea was the region on the retina where there are no what kind of cells and only what kind of cells? <clears throat> Five, four, three, two, one. Again. That's a good guess. <laughs> but it's right. Yeah, there's no rods, only cones. Oh, oh awesome. It's, oh. it's the area of the retina where if you're in bright light, the light falls on that area, so you don't need the rods because the cones are the ones that operate in bright light. Macula lutea, no rods. Should make sense. Okay, which of the following structures focuses the image onto the retina? Which of the following structures focuses the image onto the retina? Is it the cornea, the lens, or the ciliary body? Which one focuses the image on the retina? Cornea, lens, or ciliary body? <coughs> the lens, yes, great. Is that external ear, middle ear, or inner ear? The eustachian auditory tube. The eustachian tube, also called the auditory tube. Is that the external ear, middle ear, or inner ear? That's the middle ear, yeah. That's the middle ear. <laughs> the inner ear is the cochlea and the vestibular apparatus. The eustachian tube is the one that goes to your, your throat, the top part of your throat, the nasal part. What did you say about apparatus? Is it my turn? I was answering a question over here. Oh, okay. I heard that. Right? The 
middle area, you station to the part of the middle area. Start with the tympanic membrane. Oh, the Yes, the tympanic membrane. Yes. Okay, the auditory ossicles. Uh, the stapes, the incus, and the malleus. Um, what's the order? If you're going from outer or more lateral to medial, what is the order of auditory ossicles? That they are called malleus, stapes, and incus. And what is the order going from outer ear to as you move towards the inner? Stapes. Stapes is one of them. Yeah, I'm giving you the name. Names are malleus, incus, and stapes. Okay, and then second part of the question, those are all located in which region of the ear? Are those located in the external ear, the middle ear, or the inner ear? Is that the external ear, middle ear, or inner ear? Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, so the order is Miss, Malleus, Incus, Stapes, as you go from lateral to medial. And then those are part of the middle ear. Middle ear. Do you get half a Air filled middle ear. No, I guess not. Air filled middle ear. You station tube and auditory obstacles. <laughs> Why? Okay. Uh, this structure of the eye. What? What is the structure of the eye? I'm gonna describe it. It's made up of smooth muscle. It has pigmentation, and it controls the size of the pupil. Name the structure. It has pigmented cells. It's made up of smooth muscle and it controls the size of the pupil. What what structure of the eye is that? Pigmented cells, smooth muscle, and controls the size of the pupil. What is that? That is the iris. Yes, the iris, the colored part of the eye. You have to say a brown eye, that's your iris. Brown eye, that's your iris. All right, we got ten more minutes. Let's go back to a little bit of fifteen, a little, little bit, or a little bit of brain chapter, and a little bit of spinal cord chapter. Okay, the nerve plexuses. You had four. There's the lumbar, the sacral, the brachial, and the cervical. The phrenic nerve, which controls the diaphragm. Which one is it a part of? The phrenic nerve controls the diaphragm. Which major nerve plexus is that a part of? Is it the lumbar, the brachial, <coughs> the cervical, or the sacral plexus? The phrenic nerve is a part of which one of those plexuses? The choices are lumbar, sacral, brachial, or cervical. Okay, the answer is cervical. Good job, Allison. Okay, a nerve. A nerve is axons wrapped in layers of connective tissues. The nerve is axon wrapped in axons wrapped in three layers of connective tissues. The outermost protective uh, covering around a nerve, what's it called? The outermost protective covering, connective tissue covering that wraps around a nerve, what's it called? Outermost protective covering of the nerve. No. <laughs> Some cheating going on with the average, average shows here. No, 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 the cheating going on there with what's the name of us? 
Oh, 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 okay. Uh -huh. Epinurium, yeah, epinurium, yeah, epinurium. So I was thinking the axe on that covers the whole. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> Okay, which of the following structures contains sensory somas? Oh, sensory somas. That could be like a store or something. Sensory somas. Which of the following structures contains sensory somas? Is it the ventral root, the dorsal root ganglion, or the dorsal root? Which one contains sensory somas? Ventral root, dorsal root ganglion, or dorsal root? That is not a quick, strict question. That is a very straightforward question. The real question is, what kind of store would that be? Mm. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's fair. It's been pretty fun, too. I <laughs> No comment. There were some root ganglion. Yeah, well done. He's one. <laughs> Which one contains motor axons? The posterior white column, the anterior white column, or the dorsal root ganglion? What's your say, Cynthia? Anterior? anterior white oh, I'm so <laughs> proud. Everyone got it. Yay. That was a hard one. produces the cerebral spinal fluid? Pineal gland, thalamus, choroid plexus, or optic chiasm? Produces cerebral spinal fluid. lobe of the cerebrum. Which lobe of the cerebrum contains the visual cortex? Which lobe of the cerebrum contains the visual cortex? Bernie, knock it off. <laughs> <laughs> Bernie, knock it off. 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 Bernie
put you two in timeout. <laughs> I know you weren't doing anything that time. <laughs> the first, previous episode. <laughs> Okay, the occipital lobe is correct. Yes, occipital lobe. Good job. I know. All right, we got time for one more question. Then time. All right, which lobe of the brain? Which lobe of the brain contains the? Primary sensory cortex. Which lobe of the brain contains the primary sensory cortex? That's where your general sense information goes, like touch, pain, temperature. Which lobe of the brain contains the primary sensory cortex? <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs>